India is in Asia. Okay, how about this one? Um, South America. South America, that's right. right so let's begin. Tell me the continents. Tell me the continents. Tell me the continents. If you can. There's North America, South America. Europe and Asia. Don't forget Australia. Don't forget Antarctica. I just have four. You have four animals on yours? And I have a too. Okay. Do you remember, Penelope, that singular means one. just one, and plural means more than one? More than one, that's right. Okay, so let's, can, we, can you read this word? Pig. Pig. Okay, so can you, it just says pig, so there's just one pig. Which word over here looks just like that word? There you go. Pigs. Pigs. How many pigs do you have up there? Two. Two pigs. Pigs. Then which word down there looks like that one? 
pins. How three many? pins. Three pins. So that's plural because there's more than one pin. Mm. Kin. P a m p k i n. Pumpkin. Pumpkin. I just said that so fast. One pumpkin. And then the last one down there. It's really hard. A m k i n. Pumpkins. Pumpkins. How many pumpkins? Two pumpkins. Two pumpkins. Oh. So that's plural. Oh. Okay, so let's look over here in this plural column. What ending sound is there on all of those words? S is at the end of all of those words. That's right. And how about over here? Are there is that is that sound at the end? No, there's it's not. So that's how you can change a singular word into a plural word. This one is pig. But when you add a s at the end, it makes it pigs. Bug, bugs. Did you bring Flo? What the number is? Six, six tens. One ten, two ten, three ten, four ten, five ten, six. Six ten. 
And how many units did you bring? Four units. One.